Today we're talking about a new and novel treatment for the treatment of seborrheic keratosis. These are benign skin growths which occur on the skin as you can see here and many times we want to find the best cosmetic approach. A new medication that recently came out is called Escada and this is 40% hydrogen peroxide which when applied onto the lesion here as you can see you know we kind of wet the area and the solution gets absorbed into the skin here and over the next couple days it's going to get dried up scaly might get a little bit red and it will start to dissolve and fall off so this is a nice combination treatment um, for the treatment of seborrheic keratosis and the nice thing about this medication it reduces the risk of hypopigmentation that can result from other types of treatments Some of the other treatment options for seborrheic keratosis is treatment with liquid nitrogen and these were treated yesterday and these, you can see they're a little bit red and irritated and eventually these lesions will fall off and they'll get red scabby as they are now and eventually they'll fall off. You can get an immediate more reduction of the seborrheic keratosis with some of the larger ones through curatage which is a little light scraping of the lesion to remove these. Here he had several large seborrheic keratosis that we scraped off and they come off immediately and this will heal very nicely with hardly any side effects. What you see here is a good example of a treatment of a seborrheic keratosis on the left with Escada and that solution is applied to seborrheic keratosis and the result on the right where you can see it has resolved without any sequelae of hypopigmentation or any scarring. And typically one to two treatments may be necessary to ensure complete removal, but it's a nice cosmetic way of removing these seborrheic keratosis, especially on cosmetically sensitive areas such as the face.